Sykes was eventually sent to a detention center for three months by Doncaster Borough Magistrates Court in May 1964. He also received a £9 fine and a 12-month driving ban. The license disqualification meant little to Sykes, a man who'd never had a driving license in his life, yet always seemed to have vehicles at his disposal. He was sent to Her Majesty's Prison New Hall, a closed category prison for juveniles and young offenders located near Wakefield in West Yorkshire. The prison first opened in 1933 and became the first prison to implement the then experimental open prison system. This was seen as a potential method for dealing with the combined problems of the rising numbers of prisoners and the lack of proper employment for them. At first, the prison was populated by prisoners from HMP Wakefield who were due to be released, but in 1961 the prison became a senior detention centre for male young offenders. It seemed Sykes' time at the detention centre did more harm than good and by his own admission he came out with a chip on his shoulder the size of a loaf of bread. Sykes said of his experience there. You can imagine what it was like at that age, I had been fighting men for years. I pinched a car, crashed it and ended up as the youngest inmate in the custody centre. All my illusions about the system were shattered in the first few months. The screws were cowardly bullies, and by the time I came out I had a chip on my shoulder the size of a loaf. Within two years his criminal record had grown to 22 offences and inevitably a real custodial sentence was imposed. Follow our channel to find out more about Paul Sykes.